Hi everyone, I'm Elika, as you all know. <laughs> and I'm Bobby, and we are doing our presentation video on the immigration of Iran. Um, for our museum project. And we're going to be answering some questions, so here we go. So today we're going to, be, for our first thing we're going to be talking about today, we're going to be talking about some primary sources. So. Uh, some of my primary sources, I got an article for the, for the, I think it's pronounced Manjil, mm -hmm. Iran earthquake, um, on One News Box, very nice information about that earthquake there, um, I used businessinsider.com to find uh, sanctions um, <clears throat> and Getty Images to find an Iranian Iranian tweeting in line at a bakery for bread. Very interesting. So now I will be talking about um, my um, primary sources so mine are about my, one of mine are is called the human rights watch human rights world watch report of the night of 1990s so it's like the human rights of the world watch report from a document the next one is is from um Anne Mayer about the islamic rights or human rights and iranian dilemma and um, from the website JSTOR and uh, for, um, on September 1996 and the next one is called minorities at minorities at risk project chronology for Baha'is in Iran to, and I, this was published in 2004 um, they're both documents so what I think about the these like I think these are my, these are my most important artifact I mean primary sources because they all include a lot of interesting information about the human rights Iran should have and many important events happen because of this issue including the student as as an example students protesting for the freedom of speech this caused the military to get angry and burn the students dormitories dormitory rooms causing many to die or get very severely injured or also get thrown off of roofs from the military which is pretty sad and that night it was like really late that night and pretty much everybody was sleeping so it was really sad and there's also a picture of that um on our powerpoint so yes the next question we're going to be answering is how we des decided to design our um, PowerPoint. Uh, we decided to design our PowerPoints by um, each taking turns doing our favorite with our favorite things, like such as for the background color for our artifacts. My favorite color is blue, hers is orange. <laughs> so we did one would be for one the background would be blue and the other would be orange. Gradient um, style, so it's like gradient. <laughs> um, <clears throat> and for our rooms, we each did four artifacts. I did four artifacts for the first. She did four artifacts for the second. Yeah. And yeah. How I think we successfully made our design is um, by by um. We decided to try, I, well, at least I decided to try um, artifacts related to human rights over the internet or, like, on certain databases or something like that. And then I realized, why use artifacts on, online, like, a lot of artifacts online when they're just right in front of me and at home? So I used two artifacts that were from home, my dad's birth certificate and his um, child prayer book, like, his growing up prayer book shown in the PowerPoint, so <laughs> yeah, if you want to check that out. Um, I also, video. yeah, <laughs> I also included um, some online artifacts as well, 
but I thought cause but I thought it would be really cool to also add a recording to um my dad's um Iranian immigration story for everyone as well. So if you guys want to check that out, you can. It's pretty cool. So that is what I thought I did. So yeah, well on. <laughs> I got ready. The next question is why we think migration is important for our immigration group. So, Bobby's turn. Why migration is important? Migration is important in our country be, um, because if somebody like Alaka's father here did not migrate, yes. <laughs> he would still be in Iran. Or technically wouldn't even be here right now, so. Technically. Um, it is important for the economy of the world because it, it is important for culture and understanding other religions and lives. Around. Around the world. The country, yeah, in the world. <laughs> <clears throat> And bad things. Yeah. Not everybody lives in one place for their whole life. I mean, it's not like I'm I'm gonna grow up in Kirkland and live in Kirkland for the rest of my life. That's true. I agree. So in my perspective of what I, why I think um, our immigration, our group of immigrants are important, is because <coughs> um, all the immigrants um, of our country prove how difficult it is or still uh, was or still is in Iran. People have gone through so many hard trips growing up, for example, my dad in, this, in, in Iran, and living through like earthquakes and other natural disasters and the military and the government like going all out of whack and yet they're still here but i think i view it as how they still how they are these hard working people worse are survivors and they even though they lived through all these difficult times all those difficult times and hardships like right now for coronavirus and everything um they can still be happy and find a way to still live with the family and be happy and thrive. That's what I think about it, so yeah. The last question we're going to be talking about today is what we're proud about, what we, we think we are proud of about our PowerPoint we made. Um, <clears throat> uh, I'm very proud that we, finished this par that we finished our PowerPoint in one day. Look at it, it is very nice. Detailed. <laughs> Detailed PowerPoint about our four artifacts and such. And <laughs> I am proud that we finished the PowerPoint. That's some good stuff. So, yeah. And Another, <clears throat> finish it. Yeah. Yeah. And I am proud that um, how me and Bobby persevered through doing this project. We made a couple mistakes along the way. We this is our actually second video doing this. We made a mistake in a lot of mistakes in the other video. So we decided to just do it again. So that's what we're doing. And but overall, I'm super proud of what we've accomplished and I'm also proud of how our design on the PowerPoint turned out. I really liked it. Thanks, Thanks so much, much for watching. watching. Please check, check out, our out our PowerPoint, PowerPoint and, and um, <laughs> have, a, have a great summer. <laughs> Hope See you have a great summer. See you guys next year. Bye. Bye.